Hi, I'm Emma. The most difficult thing for children um, in order to become proficient readers and really effective spellers is something called phonemic awareness and it's the ability to hear speech sounds in words and to split them properly, to segment them, that means knowing their order, manipulate them. We use something called duck hands, that means we're just using our hands to say a word and split it into the speech sounds. When children can do this, and when they can use lines for spelling, that's the SSP spelling strategy, they're going to have no trouble because then all it is is a case of using the code and learning the code. But the most difficult thing is to hear those speech sounds in words and know how to split them. So if you know that the word elephant we can split as e or e f a n t, then that means we can draw that many lines and they've just got, just got to make the choices. Now, by getting children to listen for those sounds and draw the lines, it really helps them order them and they have a much better chance of getting it right. Also, because then they can see if it looks right or not. And then you can use the clouds for different choices if one looks wrong. So if a child's spelling the word fish and they're not sure about the sh at the end, f -i sh they can look at the cloud. Now the only reason it's got SH on the outside is because that's the sound pit we learn in the yellow level. But inside the clouds it shows all the pictures for SH. So they can just try the different choices and they'll see which looks right or not. We're bringing reading and spelling skills together. So just watch this activity some with some year twos. They do a memory game and then they've got to remember everything and write it down. So it's meaningful spelling but using the strategy. Although we're teaching the whole reading and spelling code in less than four terms, regardless of the year level we start it in when we're using SSP, the systematic explicit approach is, is necessary, especially for a, a certain group of the children. However, this inquiry learning is equally as important. Children are able to work at their own level and discover things, even if we haven't yet um, taught, the, taught it, and even if it's not in their level. Echidna. What is it? What is it? An animal. A, 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 a porcupine. I have never heard of that. Echidna. Is it? You taught me something new today. Thank you. I love learning something new. You'll have to bring it to get me some more electronic. That means it's not a porcupine. What is it? What is it? Oh, and I bought um. An eyeball. I bought a tablet. A one-eyed crocodile with forty-seven teeth. Rubber 
everything else out. Oh, and let's see if anyone so manages right to remember them all. Right small. Do your shopping list. Mrs. Rubber's one is the hardest one. She did palm. Yes, palm is the hardest one. Oh, I know her. Oh, I see what you mean. Yes, yeah, you had the hardest one because you were the only student that had to do all of them. You had the hardest job. You did them all. Keep going, mate. You're doing great. Now, see if you can put your sounds on. What are you doing? Her. The fan. You should have said the you should have said it. What was Mary? It's easy to get it. Zap 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 that's right, it's an I, good boy. And it gives it eat sound. Okay, what's the next sound you're hearing, Hadley? A cut. So which cut picture would it be? A C, perfect. Do you know what though? The ones that you've got the lines for, you've done heaps better. Absolutely. When they do the lines, they are so. So what are we up to? We've got hip, hip, knee, knee, cut. Okay, there we are. Oh, perfect. You've already got that one. Because people might forget where you were. Okay. What are we up to now? So we've got hip, hip, knee, cut. Oh, I heal. 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 Can you hear a pet? Can you hear a pet? Pet, pet, oh, eat, cut, oh, pet. Yeah, can you hear it? Good boy. Okay, what's the next sound that you hear? Tut, you are good at this. Helicopter. Oh, that's not the clue, that's the answer. Which R? It's I. Yum. Dad, could you? A R? Could be, but it's actually E R. My clue was guys. I think it's two P's. I think it's two P's. I think it's Z A. I think the picture for two P's. Is that the one? Yeah, that's fine. Top job. You're fantastic. Dallas, Good Dallas boy. is going to tell you that I is high. Turn the camera. You just said what the I is. Hey, wait there. I-G-H. I-G-H. Wait, where did you see on the screen? What's that? I-G-H. 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 I-G-